Welcome to our 2023-2024 Family Partnership Presentation. The mission of Palm Point Educational Research School is that through engaging, rigorous, and differentiated quality instruction, Palm Point commits to a comprehensive, collaborative system of support for all students. This ensures that Rockets are fully equipped for their next mission. How does Palm Point partner with families and support all students? Palm Point works to support all students in part through Title I and Title IX. Partnering with families is a key component to student success. Because of the number of enrolled students receiving free and reduced price lunch, Palm Point is designated again this year as a school-wide Title I school and receives federal funding to aid students considered most at risk of falling behind. Title I funding provides our school with additional instructional staff members, supplementary classroom resources, parent and family engagement events, teacher training opportunities, and tutoring for identified students. This funding and the additional resources it provides helps Palm Point ensure that all children have access to high quality educational opportunities and assistance in mastering state academic standards. Palm Point, with its unique Florida Atlantic University and St. Lucie Public Schools partnership, is officially part of the FAU Lab School District. Regardless of income level or prior year free or reduced price lunch designations, we ask all families to complete a National School Lunch Program application online each year. If you haven't yet completed it, the application can be accessed through St. Lucie Public Schools website. Thank you to all families who have done this already. An important piece of Title I includes parents and guardians' right to know details related to their child's education. This includes the qualifications and certification areas of any teacher or paraprofessional who works with your child. This also includes information about your child's performance on state assessments and notice about whether your child has been assigned or taught by a teacher who has not yet met state requirements for the subject area being taught. One essential component of Title I is family involvement, including schools collaborating with families in the development of their school improvement plans and parent and family engagement plans. Each year, Palm Point solicits feedback from families during its Spring Parent Satisfaction Survey, as well as from the School Advisory Council, or SAC. This feedback is then integrated into the New Year's School Improvement Plan Draft, which is presented to SAC for approval each August. In September, a summary of the school improvement plan will be sent home in your child's Wednesday folder and posted on the school's website. Parents are welcome to join Palm Point's monthly SAC meetings and participate in the school's decision-making process. Survey feedback from last spring will be similarly applied to our parent and family engagement plan for this school year, which will be discussed with SAC in September. This plan details school home communication processes reviews parents' right to know, and outlines activities we hope to facilitate during the school year. A summary document of this plan will also be sent home with students in September and posted on the school's website. Students in housing transition situations are supported under Title IX McKinney-Vento legislation. Homelessness is defined by McKinney-Vento legislation as individuals who lack a fixed, regular, and adequate nighttime residence, those who have a primary nighttime residence that is a public or private place, not designed for or ordinarily used as a regular sleeping accommodation, children and youths who are living in cars, parks, public places, abandoned buildings, substandard housing, bus or train stations, or similar settings, migratory children who qualify as homeless because they are living in circumstances described above. Each fall, a McKinney-Vento questionnaire is sent home with students. Families who indicate a need for support will be contacted immediately. Throughout the school year, if your housing situation changes, we ask that you reach out to Tiffany Rowley. She serves as Palm Point 7th and 8th grade counselor as well as our school's McKinney-Vento liaison. She may be reached by email or by calling the school's front office at 772-345-3245. Students in housing transition have rights, including to continue in the school they attended before they became homeless, to receive transportation to the school they attended before their family became homeless if feasible, to qualify for free breakfast and lunch automatically, to enroll in a new school without immunization, proof of residential status, 
school records, proof of guardianship, or other documents, to receive information and referrals to health, mental health, dental, and other services, and to receive school supplies, school uniforms, and supplemental tutoring if state assessment scores are less than proficient or are showing academic need as determined by the district liaison. Working together, we know we can help all students achieve success. If you have any Title I or Title IX questions, please contact Rachel Koenig or Tiffany Rowley. We value your feedback and we hope to hear from you. All feedback survey submissions are anonymous unless you submit a question and choose to include your name and phone number. If you include your contact information, you will receive a call or email back. You may access the survey online by pausing this presentation and scanning the QR code with your phone. Thank you for viewing this presentation. To receive a free dress code pass to be used on Friday, August 25th, be sure to write the code word ROCKETS on the bottom of the We Need Your Help National School Lunch Application and Annual Title I and Title IX Parent Information Form. To help facilitate this process, Please complete this form for each of your children and have each child return the form to his or her homeroom teacher before Wednesday, August 23rd to receive the dress code pass. Remember to also complete your family's food service meal application and record the five digit code provided upon submission. We appreciate your support of these important programs and our school. Mm -hmm.